Good evening, I'm Meg Gatto. Sports bars and restaurants in New Orleans are gearing up for a busy weekend. We've got the Tulane Green Wave facing off against the Ole Miss Rebels tomorrow. And the Saints take on the Titans for their season opener Sunday in the Superdome. Ashlyn Brothers joins us with more. Well, Meg, a lot of popular game day spots for sports fans say they're ready to be packed with people, especially after a super slow, hot summer. It's game time for New Orleans businesses. Go Saints, who that? You may want to brew at home, but come on and support our local business. Keep everything flowing, though. Who that? Who that nation? Who that said they're going to beat them Saints? Not this year. It's going to be a pretty good year, I hear. The long summer lull is over. Football season means opening earlier and closing later. Bigger food and beverage shipments, more people scheduled to work, specials and themed menus. Businesses say bring on the block parties. I mean, we are a sports bar, so we are here for sports. So football is like our biggest time of the year. It's an influx of people on the street. It's an influx of people from the dome to all the garages to every known local beer brewery around this place. It gets pretty hectic. Jessica Brooks is a bartender at Lucy's. We've got all these TVs transformed to be put on game day. She says football foot traffic is huge for local businesses. I might even be close enough to say an influx of at least two, three hundred more just because it is the first home game same season right now. So that number is going to keep going up. I'm going to say at least three. Maybe four. Manning's manager Merlinda Lee says servers look forward to touchdowns and tips. It gets very loud and it's exciting because like the employees are able to get in and join in with the fun. We're able to yell and scream with the, with the guests. She says things should get interesting around Manny's. We're in Tulane territory, but the man himself, Archie Manning, is a rebel and went to Ole Miss. She's expecting to see a lot of purple and gold, black and gold, a wave of green, and maybe some crimson. Archie might pop in and, and you know, it's all competitive and stuff, so it is real exciting. <laughs> Brooks says Lucy's is a Saints sanctuary. From Drew Brees on up, the team players, teammates all came to Lucy's. This used to be a very big staple for Saints coming in and people being able to even meet players coming in here. Saints players, let's go. We 100%. We got the whole city behind you. And Lucy says their hours during football season really depend on when the game starts. So the earlier the game, the earlier they open. That's so people with tickets have plenty of time to stop, grab a drink or a bite and go. Meg, back.